Once you master self-discipline, consistency, and self-control, mm. the physical will follow. It has that no bars. choice but to follow. I'm not in a rush to be skinny. I'm in a rush to be disciplined. I'm not in a rush to stop overeating. I'm in a rush to have self-control with what goes into my mouth. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Everybody wanna say shit I don't care what they say about us now mm. yeah. I don't wanna have no conversation They just wanna fuck it all up now yeah. All up. Yeah. Yeah. I like bad bitches, mad bitches Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to the channel. It's your Terry and If you are new here, make sure that you subscribe. And if you aren't here, I'm here to say thank you, thank you, thank you so much because I am approaching 70k right now and it's insane. Like I was just on the road to 50k not too long ago, and now we're on the road to 100k. And I feel like I'm gonna hit 70k by the end of September because we're super duper close. So I just want to show some gratitude and appreciation because y'all don't have to watch my shit and y'all be watching my shit and y'all be commenting and y'all be engaged and i love y'all oh so much so thank you and i've been gone for a little bit and y'all still been showing out i just love y'all oh so much and y'all know when i return i come back with the content so again thank you from the bottom of my heart so <clears throat> Today's video is a continuation of our Get Our Lives Together series, girl. So right now, I am outside of Trader Joe's. As you can see. Oh, no, baby. That's a Bob's furniture. That's... Okay. Trader Joe's is a little bit further up. Um, but I like to park far away because Trader Joe's be bumping and it don't be no parking spots up there but we're going to be doing a little grocery haul because last time within this series we were focused on our workouts and it really doesn't matter if you're working out if you're not eating correctly so I also want to go on a juice cleanse because I've been eating out a lot unfortunately and I was drinking a lot of alcohol and a lot of wines girl I'm getting chubby so we gotta get our lives together okay but before we go in let me turn my ear down a little bit because y'all like loud. Before we go in, I need, a car. I need to rent. Like, before I go in this grocery store, I need to rent. I need to rent to y'all. I don't really, I rarely rent on this channel. But somebody pissed me the fuck off today so bad, y'all. Like, girl, let me tell you what happened. So, this person asked me for help on Tuesday to be exact, right? And when they asked me and when they reached out, they asked, like, what's your bandwidth for this week like basically what's your availability and i told him i will be available to help you out on thursday and friday okay i feel like if somebody asks for your help on a tuesday and you say the turnaround time will be thursday or friday that's awesome that's great like that's a great deal take it or leave it okay so they took it oh right oh hold on he moving the carts and whatnot it's probably a little loud basically they accepted my help so i'm like all right cool today y'all is wednesday Tell me why they reached out to me talking about some. Here's a quick update. I did it. Basically, I don't need your help anymore. Basically, you don't got to worry about me no more. And the 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 worst part about it is, y'all, they added someone else to the, to the message that didn't need it to be added. Like, so what you trying to play in my face? Like, you trying to play on my top? Like, you trying to embarrass me by adding the other person? That, it, it's just, that's just unnecessary. That's very much so unnecessary. And, if, like, for what? Because I don't care. I don't I don't give a F because <laughs> I said I was going to help you on my t Like, you cannot rush somebody. You can't be impatient and rush somebody for their help when, like, they're helping you. Like, you, you, you're you now on their time. Like, what people don't understand. People be impatient. I just said, okay. Just said, okay. Now I don't got to do it. So, you're helping me out. So what was the purpose? What was the reason? Like, I don't know. People just be entitled and they be assholes. They be giving a ass to people expecting it to get kissed. And that's not finna fly over here. Like, you're just gonna look stupid. And now I know how you move and I'm never offering to help you again. So it's really a don't bite the hand that feeds you type 
type of thing because now I'm, I'm purposefully not going to help you. I don't care if I'm available to do it or not. No, the answer is no. I will, I will make up an excuse. Like, I am Miss Patty. No, I ain't married to that man like Onika is, but I ain't Miss Patty because now, now I'm on your ass, okay? So enough rambling. I'm about to show y'all what I'm going to get from Trader Joe's. I'm going to pick up. Um, a ton of things to help lunch go by easier because they be having some amazing, like, frozen options. Um, I'm getting a lot of fruits and veggies, and we're going to see whatever else I get, all right? So, let's go, and let us pray that it's not a lot of people in this fucking store on this lovely Wednesday. I don't care what they say about us now. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. I don't want to have no conversation. They just wanna fuck it all up now. Yeah. All up. Yeah. I like bad bitches, mad bitches. Hey girl, I'm back home. I actually been home for a little bit, but I had to take a little breaky break and eat me some food because I realized the only thing I had today was some toast with two eggs and some jelly, which I've never ate before by itself. Usually I do it like as a whole sandwich with bacon, but girl, I don't like bacon no more. I don't know who I'm becoming. I don't like bacon anymore. It's too salty. So I don't like it. Should I put y'all right here since my light is from this direction? I think so. <laughs> but yeah, girl, it be too salty. So I just had it by itself. And that's literally all I've had all day. And it is now 6.34. I don't know what my butt looked like. So if it was crazy, mind your business. <laughs> and, um... Yeah, so I just had some of the chicken egg roast from Trader Joe's. Look at me, already eating stuff from Trader Joe's. Um, and I tried this kombucha from Synergy. I've never had the strawberry lemonade flavor, but baby, when I tell you, this shit right here, this bitch pressure. This is so good. It tastes so good. Mmm. I told myself I was just going to drink a little bit while I was watching my YouTube and eating my food. I was watching Taylor Hope. Y'all watch her. I love her. She's bad. But, baby, this is about to be gone today because it tastes so good. I told myself to stop getting the health aid kombuchas because they said they have a lot of additives and sugars. And this one doesn't have as many. And I, and I think they're cheaper. So, y'all got me. Uh, 16 grams of sugar. Is that a lot? I don't know, bro. This one got 16. But it says zero grams of added sugar. What? It's only 60 calories, though. So ain't that good? I don't know. Do your research. But we are about to make some juices, okay? Because my insides got to get it together. I can see it through my skin. Like, this camera probably got the smoother on. But my skin is just... Oh, it's clearing up now, but you see all them dark spots. Girl, my skin was struggling. Like, the last video, y'all probably peeked. My skin was horrible, and it was throwing me off. And I had a big pimple on my chin that I wanted to just pop and get rid of, but I don't pop my pimples. I don't touch them um, because they leave worse. Like, the dark marks would be even worse if you do mess with them. So I try not to pop them, girl. Right now, I'm getting my skin together. I've been trying some new things. I've been taking some new vitamins. And so far, so good because my skin skin did clear up we gotta make sure it stay clear from what we put on from what we eating you know so if you're anything like me and you break out when you eat anything like if i drink soda i'm gonna break out if i eat too much bread that has a lot of gluten in it, i'm gonna break out which is now why i eat so sourdough bread because it has less gluten um if i eat too much dairy i'm gonna break out like ugh. if you're anything like me maybe hopping on a juice cleanse will help Clarify, detoxify your body so you can have glowy, clear skin. Um, and not just skin. Y'all know I'm trying to get my whole entire life together. So, let's make some juices. So, I'm going to make two kinds of juices. I'm going to put my orange juice in here and I'm going to pour me a glass every day. And then I'm going to put my green juices in these individual bottles. And I'm going to drink one bottle per day. So, I'm going to have one of each every single day because... They are going to have different things in them, which have different benefits for your body. My battery about to die, so let me try to hurry up and tell y'all what I'm going to put in them. The green juice is going to have kale, spinach, cucumber, celery, and a little bit of this um 
ginger lemon shot and some lemon okay that sounds good and then my orange juice is going to be carrot just carrots and pineapple and lemon and this turmeric shot i guess i was gonna get a beet because i heard beets are really good for you but girl i couldn't find no beets so maybe i'll put the green juice in here and the orange juice is in here because they look like i'm not gonna have that much of orange juice because i only bought one bag of carrots they didn't have the big carrots how annoying but we're gonna make do what we got okay and these juices aren't going to per se replace my meals because who has time for that <laughs> but they are going to be really important to uh add into my daily diet if you're wondering where my juicer is from it's from her chef Thank you to my bestie, Rahel. She got it for me for Christmas, I think. It's on Amazon. It's going to be in my Amazon storefront. I'm going to link it in the comment section for y'all below. And if you're interested in these bottles as well, I'm going to have them down below too. But girl, don't. If you want to wash them in a dishwasher, do that. But when it's time to heat your dishes, take them out because they're definitely going to uh, they're definitely gonna melt. You see that indent? You see the, how the neck crooked? Girl, I ain't supposed to look like that. One shot to your heart without breaking your skin. No one has the power to hurt you like your kid. Kept it inside, didn't tell no one else. Didn't even want to admit it to yourself. And now your chest burns and your back aches from 15 years. All in the pain, and now you always have yourself to blame if you continue to live this way. y'all so that big bowl made four big bottles i think this is a 16 ounce and then a half of a little shot which i'm gonna taste right now because i love the orange juice and like this makes your skin brighten like this makes your skin glow like people probably gonna ask you grow is you carrying a shot because it just makes your skin so glowy i will not lie to y'all and it's so sweet like you don't taste the tanginess you don't even taste the bitterness or the tanginess from like the lemon and the only thing that gives it a little like kind of taste i don't know i don't know what to describe it but that comes from the ginger from the ginger shots Like, it make you go like that. I don't, I don't know what to, I don't know how to explain it, girl. But, this tastes really, really good. Um, so that's going to last me a week, which is basically how long I plan on doing this. Because the thing about these kind of juices, you can't do them and let them sit for too long. Like, you have to make batches and batches and batches. Which is why it gets overwhelming, to be honest. I'm going to go ahead and start on the green juice while we're talking because I don't want y'all just staring at my counter the entire video. But, like, that's why juicing to me gets exhausting because you have to do it over and over again. If you let it sit, the juice is going to, like, start to start, like, the fermentation process or whatever it's called. Um, One day I opened up my juice bottle and it said, like a soda. I said, oh, heck no. I can't drink this. People say that cucumbers are really, really good for you, and I agree, but I'm like, does that include Persian cucumbers? Because Trader Joe's ain't had no regular ones. <laughs> um, so hopefully these serve the same purpose because, baby, ooh, these smell so good. I want to bite one. Hold on. I love fruit and vegetables. Mmm, mmm. Now I want salad. I don't eat all this stuff by itself. Y'all ever soak cucumbers in vinegar and salt and pepper? Oh my god. So good. 
I don't know what this is gonna taste like. I ain't never do this. Uh. <laughs> I never did this recipe, so I can't vouch for it yet. But it's not about taste. Dang, I cannot get this condom off the dildos. I know. Dark green leafy vegetables are so, so important, especially if you're trying to control or regulate your digestive system and your bowel movements if i'm gonna keep it a bean okay if you ain't use the restroom today baby you need to you need to go on a juice cleanse if you only this is tea if you only go like three times a week you need to go on a juice cleanse this is tea if you only go once a day you need to go on a juice cleanse did you know <laughs> no but seriously did y'all know that you're supposed to go after every meal I ain't know that, and I'm not on that level yet, which is why I need to be doing a juice cleanse. But, yeah, girl, you're supposed to go every single time. Like, literally, every single time you put something into your body, your body needs to get it out. Because what's going to happen, you're going to accumulate waste. And it makes perfect sense when you put it like that. Like, 2 plus 2 is 4. 2 plus 2 is 4, bookie butt. So, I'm going to go ahead and start with the cucumber. And then we're going to put in the spinach and the kale since that's already chopped up. Um, it's the same process, y'all, so I'm not going to show it. I'm going I'm to I'm come back when it's time to ball it up, okay? Okay, y'all, so <laughs> that was definitely a learning experience. Um, see, this is why you just got to do your own thing at home because sometimes the TikToks be lying. Do not waste your time trying to juice no spinach or no kale. They don't produce much juice. Like, stick to things that are high in water. So, like, oh, my God, watermelon will probably be so fun to juice. Pineapples, celery produce a lot of juice. Um, I knew the cucumber and the celery was going to perform well, but I did, like, raise my eyebrow at juicing spinach and, and, and kale. Like, you're better off just having a salad or... Or you could make it into a smoothie, but juicing? No, ma'am. It was a waste of time. I was doing handfuls of spinach and kale, and I wasn't getting no damn juice. What's that about? So, y'all see how green that is? Oh, my lancer. And I basically have a full bottle. So that's good. It stinks. <laughs> I ain't gonna tell y'all no lie, this thing, so I know it's gonna taste nasty. Simple. Simple as that, but health is well. Health is well. <laughs> I know it's gonna be nasty. I'm not even gonna sit here and lie to y'all, like, what? I'm about to pour a little bit in this cap because I'm intrigued to see, like, what it actually tastes like. It's not as bad as I thought. It's not bad. It just tastes like a leaf. Literally a leaf. <laughs> it tastes like a leaf, but oh um, god, like I wish I was doing this for like a whole two weeks or something so I can come and show y'all a before and after. But I will be doing a skincare routine and just like pay attention. If you see the way my skin, because it's not cute, if you see the way my skin looks now. When I come back and I do my skincare routine, I'm going to look like a whole different person. Simply from drinking these juices. And I'm also going to personally see a difference when it comes to like my digestive system. But yeah, y'all. That is it for today. I'm going to see y'all tomorrow when it's time like actually cooking and whatnot. Because I did all this healthy stuff and I'm definitely about to bust down on some pizza. <laughs> before bed. And I want to try this ice cream that I got from Trader Joe's. Let me show y'all. Have y'all ever had this? This tastes... This sound like it's gonna taste good. It look like it's gonna taste good. Cookie butter, that sound fire, okay? And let me show you my favorite, my all-time favorite, like little side snack to get from Trader Joe's. This right here, I already did a short on my channel if you wanna go find it of how to prepare this this is so stinking good it was some really good chips oh my god they're with their blue corn tortilla chips so good and you know while i got my fridge open i hope y'all ain't see my butt just now because i don't got one with no pants but this chicken shawarma the shawarma thighs 
so stinking good. Oh my god. If you put these on a grill pan with the like grill lines and you really get a good char and you pair it with some rice and some vegetables. So 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 good. Um you probably could do like you probably could like oh I've since it does these thighs don't come with bones in them so I've chopped this up and like put it on a salad. I put it in tacos before it's so good. Now something that I'm trying for the very first time is a carne asana I mean carne asada I'm intrigued to see what this tastes like. I want to do some steak tacos with this. It says it's thinly sliced beef sirloin. Um, and it says authentica. So hopefully it tastes really, really good. Let me know in the comments if you had this before. But alright, now I'm done and I will talk to y'all tomorrow. I just came back from my hot girl walk and I took a quick shower and I just did my skincare routine. So I look a little crazy, but it's okay. Um, I had my egg bites in the oven and they smell so fucking good. <laughs> I play too much. They smell so good. I'm so ready to try one. But yeah, this is my first bite. Cheers, bestie. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, these are perfect. You make six at once, so I'm gonna have two a day until I get tired of them. If you're a mommy, definitely make these because I know you probably gotta spend time in the morning feeding your kids. You probably like, what am I feed myself? Boom, egg bites. They already done. They're really, really good. These are fire, oh my God. Especially if you add like, how so so sriracha? OMG, these are so good. So I'm going to go enjoy these and I also have some work to do. So I'm going to come back to y'all when it's time to uh, cook dinner. Okay. We are back. Yes, I'm still in my robe. And don't give a fuck. And down. One thing about me, baby, I love a good robe, honey. I am going to be comfortable in my home. So, just finished making dinner. It was super quick. All I did was steam some broccoli with some salt, pepper, lemon juice, and lemon pepper seasoning. A little bit of onion powder. I steamed my rice. And this is the chicken that I made from Trader Joe's. It's their barbecue teriyaki. Now, I ain't gonna lie. First, all I saw was teriyaki. So, I will rate the sauce a 8 out of 10. That barbecue part kind of throws me off. Because I don't know about y'all, but I taste everything before. Like, I taste things as I'm cooking. And I had taste the sauce by itself. I'm like, I don't know if I like that or I like that. But then I taste a piece of chicken after it was cooked, and it was good. So, y'all, I didn't take no picture. For the thumbnail. Hold on. <laughs> yeah, we gotta get the content, baby. What? How could I forget that? Who am I? Hold on, we gotta make this piece of... No! 
Hold on, we gotta make this look right. The way y'all was about to F that bite up, y'all, why y'all ain't tell me? Okay, that should be good enough. Anyways, back to my first bite. And I put the chicken in the air fryer um, over top of some aluminum foil to keep the juice. Um, I cooked the chicken by itself for like six minutes first. Then I added the sauce, tossed it, and let the sauce like coat on it and get a little like crispy in the air fryer. So, this little bite is sad because I can't bite big bites at one time. But, cheers bestie. This is good. This reminds me of the Chinese stores in the mall. If you know, you know. If you know, you know. This sauce is good on the chicken, actually. You see how it's juicy and it got a little char to it and it's a little crusty? Yes, ma'am. Mm-hmm. You see how my broccoli is seasoned? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> so yeah that really wraps up this video i hope y'all enjoy everything from the trader joe's haul to the juice thing to the cooking um if you did please give me a like that that just lets me know that you enjoyed this type of content so i'll be sure to do more videos like this in the future so let me know girl chat to me in the comments talk to me about anything ask me anything you want about the entire video about other things that i didn't mention because i always just chat to y'all so yes Again, thank you so much for watching, and I will tune in with y'all in the next video. Bye, mamas. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um.